I'm Mrs. Hasty, and today we're going to have fun with Tally Mark Edition. Let's start with a rhyme. Three gray mice, three gray mice, see how they run, see how they run. If two more mice join the group, how many mice do we have in all? Five gray mice, five gray mice. We started with three gray mice, we added two more mice, and we ended up with five. That's an addition story. Did you know that we can use tally marks to help us with addition stories? We started with one, two, three gray mice, and then two more came along. One, two more gray mice. We've made five tallies. A group of five tallies looks like this. Four tally marks across and one tally mark that slashes them. Let's use a tally chart to start counting some pets. Let's use a tally chart to find out how many dogs we have how many cats we have, and how many pets we have in all. Let's make a tally for each dog and cat we have. We'll start on this side. We have one dog, one tally mark, a cat, one tally mark, another dog, another cat, now we have counted two of each. Another dog and another dog. Back up at the top, we have another dog. When we get to five, we make a slash across. That makes it easy for us to know that we've counted five dogs so far. Now we've counted another cat and another cat. Back up at the top, this is our fifth cat. Let's make a slash across. Another dog, that's six. Another dog, another dog, and another cat. We have five six, seven, eight dogs, and five, six cats. How many do we have in all? What is eight plus six? Let's use tallies to help us. We have two groups of five tallies. Then we have one, two, three tallies by themselves up here, and one tally by itself down here. So all together, how many tally marks do we have? Five, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. We have 14 pets. Let's do some more tally mark addition. Are you ready to add with tallies? Let's start with six plus three. Six. Let's make six tally marks. One, two, three, four. Remember our fifth is always a slash. Six. Six tally marks. Now let's make three tally marks. One, two, three. Six and three. Let's group those tally marks together. We have one group of five. One, two, three, four, five. We have a tally mark by itself. And then three tally marks by themselves. One, two, three. Now, how 
many tally marks do we have all together? Five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have nine. Six plus three equals nine. Are you ready to try it again? Let's start by making nine tally marks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine tally marks. Now let's make seven tally marks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven tally marks. Nine plus seven. Let's put all those tally marks together. A group of five and a group of five. So let's make two groups of five down below. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Now we have four by themselves. One, two, three, four, and two by themselves. Well, if we put this two on here, this four will need to make one of these by themselves, a slash for five, and then the last one by itself. Now we have three groups of five and one group of one. Let's count. Five, 10, 15, 16. 16 tallies. Nine plus seven equals 16. Can we make it a little bit harder? Now we need to find the missing add-in, the missing number. Two plus what equals six? Well, we can use tallies to help us. We already have two tally marks, I'm going to use a different color to count up to six. Two, three, four, five, six. Six total tallies. How many blue tallies do we have? Because our black tallies is part of our two. So to find our missing number, we need to count the ones we made with blue. One, two, three, four. Four blue tallies means our missing number is the number four. Two plus four equals six. Let's try it again. Three plus what equals 10? We have three already. Let's count up to 10. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We have 10 tallies. Our missing number is how many tallies we have in blue. Let's count them. We have five, all blue here. Six, seven. Seven blue tallies means our missing number is seven. Three plus seven equals 10. Thanks for doing tally mark addition with me today. And don't forget to come back again for more learning fun. Keep learning at home by using sticks to make tally marks. Play with your food by making tally marks in pudding or yogurt. Two colors of wiki sticks are great for making tally marks when doing your math. And there's always printable resources available at my teacher's store at teacherspayteachers.com. Don't forget to subscribe.